Hello everybody, this is Marcelle, and thank you for watching. And for those who are new, welcome to my channel. I'm sorry you guys, I have not been um, videoing any new hair videos. However, I do have one today for you. And it has to do with our awesome Ken to Shea Butter products. So if you are interested in knowing exactly the verdict um, in regards to this awesome product, please stay tuned. Okay, you guys, welcome back. Um, I'm just going to get straight to the point. I have been using Cantu Shea Butter, I think, pretty much since the last time I did a hair video. And my hair absolutely loves every product in this particular line. 100%. I have never really found a, I want to say local or a product where I can actually just go to immediately and purchase it from Walgreens, Walmart, CVS, Target, wherever, and it doesn't cost as much. This is one of the most inexpensive products I've ever um, purchased that my hair loves. Oh my God, this is ridiculous. How much my hair loves this product. However, my body does not. I have been going through for the longest trying to figure out what it is that keeps breaking me out. I am not allergic to a lot of things, so I was trying to figure out what is going on. I gave up some of my fish um, <laughs> foods that I really liked thinking that was it, wasn't it. I changed some of my makeup thinking maybe that's it. Nope. So I was just kind of, I was, maybe it was my, my, uh, washing, what I was washing with my, you know, washing powder or whatever, my liquid. <sighs> nope, nope, nope. So I was like, oh God, what could it be? I've tried everything. And I remember one, um, one day after I was working out, I was taking a shower and I was using the, the rent. Y'all know the rents that I use. I was telling you about that. If you have not checked the Cantu uh, rents out, please do check, check the link above when I talk um, in depth about that particular product. So ridiculous y'all this is crazy um so i was washing my hair and as i was rinsing my hair out my body started itching i mean itching bad and i was thinking huh so and then i started kind of recalling some incidences where i was working out and i started sweating really bad and i start, i started um getting hives in my back. I had some of my ladies in class was like, what's what's wrong with your back? What, what what's because um I had on like a um little sports bra and I was just a scratching and scratching and they're like, what's going on? So I said, look at my back, look at my back, what's on my back? And they were like, oh my God, you have all these hives. And I, I thought it was maybe it's a sweat. Um I'm like, oh God, what could it be? So I'm thinking it was probably, you know, perfume I had on. I was just like What's going on? I was taking Benadryl every single day, like clockwork. I was popping Benadryl like candy, y'all. No lie. And my husband was like, babe, you can't keep popping Benadryl. You need to figure out what's going on. So I washed my hair again one day and I started breaking out. I was breaking out from my face, my ears, my neck, my chest my arms, my hands, the, my palms, yeah, yeah, that, yeah, that, my knees, literally, <laughs> down to my toes, my feet. Usually when someone, you know, scratch in the bottom of your foot, it's supposed to tickle, right? Uh, no, it was feeling so good because it was itching so bad. My back, my butt, y'all, my thighs, 
my ears. So my body, pretty much my body. Even, I think sometimes my butt cheeks was, you know, irritated. Because you know when you wash your hair, it goes down your back, down your crack. Mm-hmm. Y'all feel me. You know what I'm talking about. So I was thinking, okay, please don't let it be this Cantu Shea Butter. So I stopped using the Cantu Shea Butter for about two whole weeks. And the first week, no hives, y'all. And I was like, well, maybe, you know, it was something else. So I tried it again. Hives. So I tried at another week. Nothing. No hives. And I stopped using can too. And my hives never came back. So I started Googling can too shea butter allergic reactions. And lo and behold, there are more people like me. Who's actually allergic to this stuff? I cannot tell you which ingredient that I'm allergic to, which sucks. Um, I'm so upset because my hair loves it, but my body does not. So I have all these Cantu Shea Butter products. And I'm going to show you how much of this product that I really invested in my own money. And now I have to either give it away or throw it out. Matter of fact, I have someone, a co-worker says that she wants it. So I may just go ahead and give it to her. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and give it to her. But I'm going to show you guys a picture of all the products that I purchased with my own money. And now I can't use it anymore. So now I'm having to go back to my faithful, more expensive product that my hair also loves. Um, and it's called Allocate Natural. She is the bomb. Her name is Rochelle, if I'm not mistaken. And I'll put her information down in the description box too. My hair loves her products and always has, but my money does not sometimes. So, you know, if I have if I could if I have a choice of paying $5.99, $6.99, $7.99 versus $14.99, $15, $16, $17.99, which one do you think I'm gonna go for? Uh, yeah, and that's what the Cantu Shea Butter was. It was an inexpensive, hair-loving product. And Allocate Natural was the a little bit more expensive, hair-loving product. So I'm back to my Allocate Naturals with my, um, I use the, the, the leave, the spray leave-in conditioner now. And I also use the, um, the Shea Parfait. So, if you want to know more about that product, I can come to you and do a video review on that product. Just let me know. I, everyone has done the uh, review on that. But for my hair, my hair loves it. I just didn't want to come out of the pockets paying double digit for it. That's all. So, again, I will show you a picture of all the products at the end of the video. So, you can kind of see exactly what I purchased from the leave-in to the rinse. To everything in this particular line and now I have to just give it away because I am allergic to it um, I will also be coming back with a video in regards to my hair growth and what it's been doing and how it's been acting after I am actually using the mini twists I did a video on how protective style and exercise took out my hair so if you have not seen that video please check that um, video out. I'm going to leave the um, info card link up there. So please check that out. I will also put the link in the description box. So you can also check that out. So if you exercise a lot, if you sweat a lot, and you also utilize protective styles to protect your hair, there's some information you need to know um, while you, you know, using that particular method to protect your hair. Okay. So I think that is all about my bittersweet bye-bye Cantu products. I am allergic to the product, so, but it works. I will tell you that if you don't have an allergic reaction, go try it out. Please go try it out. Um, yeah, go try it out. But unfortunately, that's not my testimony. So I want to come and share that information with you guys. And again, I love you guys. And don't forget, 
Be you and keep it moving.